you know, I was like pot pie, I'm craving pot pie. All of these things that I was like pushing away in my brain were like, ooh, so since you had Taco Bell, can I come in too? So yeah, you know, in theory, having a small piece of pot pie with some salad or vegetables wouldn't be that bad. But again, that's, I think one food I just can't control myself over. I have this, I see this huge tray um, and I'm like, I know that I, you know, I could technically, I'm an adult. I'm, I, you know, I could do what I want. I could eat the whole thing. You know, I, I, and I could eat the whole thing. I would feel sick, but I, I could do it. I have done it before. So, um, no, it's just not something I can really control myself with. So I'm not going to make that for a long while, maybe ever. I'm not going to make that for a long while maybe ever three weeks later i wanted to show you a clip of also i made another pot pie and i went i filmed it i wanted to film like a little bit of the cooking process to show you how i do it some people were asking me how i made it um i did um i did make it in a very like half the size dish of the last time so there's not as much chance for overeating and i split it with my husband sure jan and so yeah that was the trick made it in a smaller pot in a smaller dish like this kind of dish so that you know again prevent overeating of it even foodie aka Miriam, knows she's not telling the truth and remember when foodie got caught lying about not smoking weed she basically told us that her lying is okay if she doesn't want us to know the truth and that makes her a lying liar who lies I say no, it's because I don't want you to know the truth. Like, if I don't have to tell you if I'm smoking or what I'm doing if I don't want to, you know? So if you want to be butthurt over that lie of me saying no, that I'm not smoking because I don't want anyone to know, um, then be mad. I kissed Neville.